Hey guys, welcome back. Today I want to talk to you about One United Bank, which is the largest black owned bank. And for those of you who don't know it as that, you might know it as the bank that issued the Harriet Tubman debit card, the one that has the Wakanda sign. And I'm going to tell you why you shouldn't bank with that bank. One United Bank likes to tote the fact that they have all of these assets and they are the largest black owned bank. But when you dig into their past, when you dig into their history, they have a really, really shady history. The owner and the founder, this guy right here, Kevin Cohey, he allegedly spent over a lot of the bank's money funding his own lavish lifestyle. Allegedly, the bank bought him a $8 million house in Malibu. They bought him five cars. He was spending the customer's money on drugs and other paraphernalia and then when the bank fell on hard times he asked the government to give him a 50 million dollar tarp loan um the government didn't eventually the government did settle on giving him a 12 million dollar loan for the bank on the deal that he returned all the money he spent on his lavish lifestyle um the payments have now come due for that $12 million loan that the government gave him and he has not paid it back. Um, One United Bank also has a history of denying customers for loans that they would qualify for. It's the same shady business practices that the commercial banks are doing. So if you wanna keep your money at a black owned bank, I highly recommend it. There are a list of them. I'm not gonna tell you which ones, but I will tell you to stay the hell away from One United Bank.